Have you ever gone to a mall or anywhere in public and just took two seconds to watch people as they walk by? These days, people are doing this. They're staring at their phone, walking around, and oblivious to where their head is in space. One really easy thing to do, and is a, a rule in my office, is that if, if you're gonna use a cell phone or a, an iPad, whatever it is, is that you are better than the device that you're using. And the question you should ask yourself is, should you have to go to the device, or should the device have to come to you? In that, I mean, if you're going down to look at your phone, then clearly the phone is winning. If you bring the phone to you, then you're winning. Simple thing to do, simply put your wrist underneath your elbow and away you go. You can text all you like and yet you're not bending your head forward for hours on end. Try it. Next, at work, if you're at a desk, uh, a really easy tool to have by your computer screen is just a simple mirror. The idea is that your brain can recognize when you're in a poor posture because you can see yourself right beside your computer. So every now and again, you take a quick glance over in that mirror, and if you're doing one of these, your brain's like, ah, oh, hey, pull it back. Really simple tool, costs you a dollar at the dollar store. Well, it's not a dollar anymore. Anyway, 